Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another reaction. My name is Ryan, and we are about to react to the Tim Boach versus Jacare Ronaldo Souza fight, UFC 208. Let's get into it. Hopefully, I don't have any problems with uh, watching because it's been freezing up a little bit for the last two fights, so I didn't really get to catch a whole lot of those fights. But it, I think I fixed it now. Had to make sure I fixed it for this fight. Anyway, let's get to get it underway. Some dancing around. Ooh, Boach went for an overhand early. Boach is definitely going to be looking for the um, for the knockout as he has in his last couple fights. Undefeated since returning to the division, the middleweight division. He's going to look to keep this one standing up probably for all three rounds while Jock Ray... I would have to assume would be more of the um, the one attempting takedowns and stuff like that. Boach is the underdog in this fight. So is the third. Setting up one. Oh, and he shot for the takedown. Boach, good defense. Jacare got him locked up in the clinch. Takes a body shot. Turn to the commentary. Lands a nice knee to the midsection of Boach. Boach is the bigger as far as uh, body size go. But I would say uh, some decent strength for both men in the fight. Jack Ray also landed a nice clean shot to the forehead. But yes, definitely very impressive for Boach to uh, be able to stuff that takedown. That could be a uh, bit of a game changer. Now Soza is going to have to set up those takedowns a little bit better. Jacare went for a kick. Boach, good head movement thus far. Jacare went for a shot. Not a takedown shot, a uh, punch, obviously. Oh, good leg kick by Boach. Jacare landed a clean body shot. Oh, Boach, I think he landed a shot there. Jockery looks to be okay. First, it looked like he took a hard one, though. Boach is hunting for that overhand. Oh, but he made a mistake, swung a little wild, and Jockery has taken him down. Mounting him. Boach defending with the leg. Jacare ha has him in side control now, looking to transition. Boach is not in a very advantageous position. Jacare is looking to go across his body. Crowd getting into it a little bit. Boach defending well for now. He's got the one arm trapped. Jacare. Looking for the full mount, but Boach does have that arm trapped. Boach tried to cage walk, and it might have cost him position. Boach has still got the knee up, defending, but full mount. Jacare just one of the best at the ground. Just one of the best on the ground, period. Lands a couple of clean shots to the head. Boach going for or Boach made the mistake. He gave up the arm. Jacare's got it. It's clean. That's gonna be it. And he taps out. Jacare Souza with another victory. Just took a hold of that arm and within seconds. Nice Kimura. Perfect. Perfect by Jacare. He waited, looked for his opportunity. Boach swung a little wild, and Jacare made him pay. He took him down and just smooth transitions and eventually got him in the Kimura lock and tapped him out. Impressive. This guy's got to be next in line for a title shot. How can you not give this man a title shot at this point? I don't think there's literally anybody who's not already in the middleweight title picture right now that can beat him. I mean, you could run him back with Luke Rockhold or maybe give him Weidman, but... I really don't see the point. This man just wins fight after fight. Obviously, he did drop the one to Yoel Romero, but, you know, Mr. Roy Rage, no offense to any fans of his, but 
there's definitely an argument against uh, Yoel, period. But he will be getting the next shot. So I would think that the winner of Yoel versus uh, Michael Bisping would have to go through Jocker right next. He just sliced through Boch's ground defense like butter, trapped the arm, and within seconds, thought he might break it, but Boch had to tap. He had that arm dead to rights. The second he got a hold of that arm, he just started bending, got the Kimura. Great, great fight for Jacare. Gotta be on his way to a title shot. Wish the lighting was a bit better in here right now, but nonetheless. That is gonna do it for this reaction. Obviously, Jacare, the winner by submission early in the first. Great, great job by him. Hopefully he is next in line for a title shot after Yoel and Michael Bisping run it. So that is going to do it. Thanks everybody so much for watching. Make sure to check out my gaming channel in the description as well as subscribing over here to Ryan M Entertainment. I will be doing all of the UFC pay-per-view and special events reactions for the big fights. And uh, other than that, Twitter and Instagram also in the links down there in the description. Peace out.